Hi, this is Val Vandervoort of Veritas Homes. I'm Liz Mann. Good morning. Isn't this hysterical? So we tried to do Facebook for a while. There had um, a two-person, you could do a remote broadcast with two people, but it seems like that is no longer available. So um, we got creative, and uh, Liz and I are FaceTiming. Um, it's like my my computer buddy over here. Um, so, yeah, we're trying to keep... Welcome to our home. Right? Yes, right? Uh, yeah. Don't look around. <laughs> yeah. I have very controlled access point here. Yeah, you. right. <laughs> but uh, we thought it'd be fun to go, you know, fresh like we're living at home. So, um, glasses <laughs> on, no makeup, just it's raw. Right. Um, <laughs> we are trying to keep life as normal as possible. Um, so that means continuing on with surreal estate. I've actually had uh, hopes of really doing a short broadcast every day, but, um, it's just more chaotic than you <laughs> would think, right? Uh, sheltering in place. Um, it yeah, has been, sure. yeah, it's been interesting to see how programming in general has changed. Um, I was, saw a little bit of Stephen Colbert the other night broadcasting, um, his monologue from his, his bathtub and, um, it didn't go over very well, so I hope I hope this goes over a little bit better. <laughs> well, nobody expects us to be uh, sitting behind desks with a three-piece suit on, right? No, uh, no. Nope. Yeah. Um, so obviously, it's an interesting time in the market. So we wanted to share some observations that this is what we're seeing um, as going on. It's everything's different in yeah, our world for sure. Um, it's yeah. been interesting. There's been some conversation about. Um, is is real estate considered an essential um, activity? Uh, I think some of us probably, I mean, I, I definitely think there are times when, yes, it, it, it absolutely is. Um, I think there's a lot of times right now where things can pause, but clearly people need housing and have leases that are ending. And um, especially in the yeah. rental world, like you really have to believe that that is an essential service. Um, Nevada definitely seems to have stated that it believes it to be um, an essential service. So um, I think we don't have a lot of direction on that and kind of taking cues where where we can get it. Yeah, I mean, the um, association, of the California Associate, Association of Realtors and most of the brokerages have been very clear saying, you know, shut, shut down the showings and, you know, um, shelter for sure. Um, but you know, how long we can do that without people, yeah. you know, having places to live, yeah. <laughs> you know, ending up, ending up homeless. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Um, which is even more dangerous now. Right. Yeah. Um, yeah. So thought we'd look at the numbers. Um, we, the inventory is dropping across the board. Um, the homes have been sold or withdrawn from the market. Um, and, um, uh, very few people coming on the market. And the interesting thing about that is that, um, I was kind of watching what was coming on, and a lot of it was stuff that um, I had seen hints of. <laughs> you know, there had been like a top agent network post, or you know, some things. So there weren't a lot of surprises. Yeah, um, and it is interesting too. We didn't really put this into our script, but let me just riff on this right now. Is that the MLS is actually um, yeah. changing some of the rules uh, for the MLS as far as. Uh, when you withdraw that your days on market stop, they actually had said something about days on market would stop as of March 16th. Is that the date you remember, Liz, in the yep. email? Yep. And yet we've continued yep. to see them increase. So we're curious as to, um, I'm going to be calling the MLS today to see what really is going going on there. Um, so so that as may be a programming glitch as yeah. opposed to an install. Yeah policy change. Yeah, yeah, that they just yeah. haven't been able to get the programming done yet on that possibly. Um, yeah. So then uh, as far as county goes, it is down 13% from last week. That's pretty uh, pretty interesting. And a year ago, the county went up 7%. So Yeah, we know that that's the direction it should be headed instead of down yeah. um, such a massive yeah. amount. Um, a year ago, San Carlos was at 22. Um, it's sitting at 12 today. Last year, Belmont was at 10, and surprisingly, it's up to 12 now, so it's actually higher. Yeah. Um, and one observation that I just finally kind of clicked as I've, you know, been looking at the numbers over 
uh, over the past actually five, six weeks, I went back to look and see that um, uh, Belmont is kicking San Carlos's ass as far as movement of the market. So um, the days on market for the active is significantly lower. The days on market for the pendings is significantly lower. Um, just things that come, I think there's more, it tends, it's tending towards more modestly priced homes in Belmont and they're flying yeah. off the shelf. And then um, I think there's just some unrealistic sellers in San Carlos. And I think, oh, if you were unrealistic a week ago, boy, you are really unrealistic this week. Yeah, for sure. Um, and normally at this point of our broadcast, we tell you about the hot homes, but we are sheltering. So we have not seen them. Yeah. <laughs> Um, so, um, you know, when, when we get back out there, we'll get back out there with you, with you as well. Yeah. So everyone hang in there. Yeah. Get creative. Love everybody. What was that? I'm just sending love to everybody. Yeah, me too. Um, yeah. Take care of yourselves and your neighbors and, and hang in tight, hang in tight. Yeah. We all wish right. you all the best from Veritas Homes in these, yeah, uh, interesting so. times. Yeah. Thanks for joining us. Yeah. Bye, everybody.